Hi, come on in, come in. I'm so excited that you're here. Shut the door quickly. I don't want anyone to see you in here. No, I don't want anyone saying I'm giving you preferential treatment. I am, but I don't want anyone saying that. I have been waiting for this day since before you were an elfling. You're graduating and I, as the seamstress extraordinaire, get to get you your whole elf outlook. I'm so excited. I know. I know. I don't care if you were top of the class or bottom of the class or somewhere in the middle. You finished. Not everyone gets to be an elf. And you get to decide from here if you're going the elf route or the fairy route. Oh, I remember when I had to choose. Yep. Oh, I went the elf route. I wanted to be an elf more than anything. I never regretted my decision. But at the same time, I used to look at fairies and just go, I wonder. So choose wisely, my dear. Choose wisely. No, retiring wasn't... Okay, yeah, it was. Retiring was hard for me. But when they offered me the job as chief seamstress, I took them up on it. And one of the reasons I did was because I knew you were going to be graduating. Plus, I'm very good at it, darling. <laughs> so, have a seat. And we'll get started. Hmm. What shall we start with? Oh, I know, I had to take my nails off. Oh, you poke a couple corneas and they have a fit. Anyways, when I'm outfitting people, I can't wear my nails. That's okay, it's fine. Okay, let's see. I have my tape measure so I can measure your face. I have my scissors for any last minute adjustments. Um, let's start. Let's start with your eye look. Do you like mine, darling? I custom did mine, goes with my eyes. But I pulled three looks for you and each one is a little different and you tell me what you wanna do. So the first one we have is this one. And you can see the pearls and the purple and crystal. This is a very, to me, very minimalist. Well, obviously I think it's minimalist. Um, look, yes. And we can adjust it if you want. I mean, if you don't want that top one, we can take it out or I can even make it a single V. It's up to you, darling, okay? So that's choice number one, okay? Choice number two, a little bit more glam and it's straight crystals with a few Aurealis. And we know how much I love the Aurealis. I just wanted something that went with my eyes. Now this one is very, very dramatic. Yes, I do too. It feels so good. Yes, and again, adjustable. If you don't want the bottoms, we can take the bottom off. And if you don't want the top, take the top off or we're really one over. Okay. The last one to me, the most dramatic. Are you ready? Okay. What do you think of this one? This one is all purples and pinks. It has the bottom parts. It has goes right down to the start of your nose. you will be able to call them on and off at will. Once I attach them and we run the wand over it, you will be able to at will, but they will be permanent. You won't be able to change to something else. That's why you have to choose wisely, my dear. You want to see them again? All right, we'll try. Let's do, we can do, this one yes one two or three 
You choose, darling. Which one do you want? <gasps> An excellent choice. It's the choice I thought you would pick. Number one it is. Tell me, what was it? The pearls? The crystals? The multicolored? It just spoke to you. You make me so proud. That's how to tell. So I will put this aside and we'll get that book put on you in just a few minutes. I want to make the choices first. Now, the next choice we have. Now, the headdress that does go with that is this one. Okay. We have a lot of flowers. We have the white flowers, yellow, greenery, a gossamer bow. And you would wear it just like this. Here, let me take my hair out and up. So you can see what it looks like up. No, it's up to you, darling. Okay. This is the one that goes with it. Let me try to show you. See if you can get a better look. Oops, it helps if I don't put it upside down. Okay. Once the ears are on, you'll see a much better look. Oh yes, you choose your ears, my darling. I wanted you. I don't want anyone saying you copied them. I love all my elflings the same. Just I love you more. <laughs> yes, this is my ear box. And we have the best elf ears in here. Perfect for elf or fairy. And we have different sizes and different colors. And you choose whatever ones you like. First ones are my absolute favorites, darling. And it's these ones. Are you ready? The mocha in them is just so beautiful. The point is very well done. You will be able to hear for miles around with these ears. That's choice one. And then choice two is the large pale one. They have the point. Yes. No, no, they're worn like this, darling. So you do just fine. Yes. When you retire, you lose them, but that's okay. You maintain the hearing. <laughs> you don't like these ones at all? Okay. We do have, where's my tan ones? Here we are. I do have the lighter shade, the in-between shade. You see? These are very nice. They're very complimentary. Oh, you'd look good in any of them. These are a maybe. Okay. Now, we do have the very smallest ones. Um, I had to wear the small ones because of my, I have a small face. So I did do the very small ones for myself. And we can adjust them. You can have them flat to your face. You can have them sideways, however you like them, darling. Maybe, okay. And then we have a smaller version of these ones. Yes, actually these, I have to measure your face still, but definitely, oh, these are a high maybe. A high maybe, okay. And then the last pair I have is a smaller version Okay, all right, let me measure you. What did I do with my measuring tape? I had it here. Oh, I bet you when I move my hair. Okay, that's fine. I don't need it to measure. I can measure you with my fingers. So I'm just going to put the center here and I'm just going to And I'm just going down now. And I'm just going to span it. Okay. 
definitely would not do the largest. Definitely not. Have you decided? These ones? Oh, excellent choice. Oh. Okay, now I do have some presents for you first in this treasure box. These are from me to you. I'm just going to open it. And the first thing is your angel from your auntie angel, um, pure amethyst, and she will protect you. Yes. Oops. I also have for when you need to be very, very small. Yes, once you have all of your outfit and you graduate tomorrow, you will be able to shrink it down into your house. And I added electricity for you. Yes. You can decorate it however you like. I put castles in it for you. Do you see them? It's absolutely it's making me all misty. was given to me by my mentor. I remember the day she gave it to me. It's to go on your new ear. It will become permanent jewelry if you want it. If you don't want it, that's fine. You can remove it, yes. You can just wear it for special occasions if you want. It's diamond and pearls set in a platinum setting. And if you look very closely, the palest rubies. Yes. Yes. And you can swing. And when you're dancing and they swing around, that, my darling, is from me to you. Now, are you ready for the transformation? It is time. First thing we're going to put on are your ears. All right. You know, it doesn't hurt, honey. It doesn't. It, um, there's a warm sensation. And then as it bonds, you'll feel just a little bit of tightness. And then they'll just feel normal and natural. And this is the wand that I will use to attach it. bearer of these years, be blessed and protected. Okay, come here. That's it. Don't wiggle. <laughs> flat. Oh, flat. All right. Time for the second ear. May the bearer of this ear be blessed and protected. Okay. Here we go. Flat again. You got it. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And now for your eyes. Yes. So, I'll take that off. Now these, I'm not gonna lie, they're gonna pinch a little bit as they go on, but only as they fuse. I'm just blessing and protecting them for you. All right. Oh, how beautiful. How utterly, utterly beautiful. Don't wiggle. Don't wiggle. Okay, now I'm just going to run this across. Fuse them on. Excellent. Thank you. And now, for your garland, I think, do you want the bow at the side like this? 
oh, what a great idea. You're right. With the bow on this side and the diamond on this side, that would look beautiful. Then absolutely. Ready? And I can just get that on there. Excellent, excellent. Perfect. Now, take the wand. Right. Excellent. And we'll now put your jewelry on this side. I'm so proud of you. Okay, just gonna hang it. And we're just gonna fuse it. There we go. Oh, let me get it more there. Yep. There we go. Gonna bring it around to the side. Excellent. Perfect. Now I just need to make a few trimmings. Don't worry. Excellent. Oh, I'm so happy. Now All else have their swords. Now, for you, according to your defense teacher, they suggested that I show you three different swords and allow you to choose. Just trying to find the other sword that he suggested. There we go. All right, my darling, we have three of the swords for you to choose from. We have this one. This actually is one of the most popular. Okay. It has quite a sharp point. Right. This one, very buccaneer. With the hand hold. Yes. Yes. And then this one. I like this one, it reminds me of crowns, of royalty. What did I have? <laughs> Darling, I love you, but you're far too young to know about that story. Suffice it to say, myself and a couple others, um, we caused a certain set of swords to be discontinued. Elves will be elves. <laughs> Have you made a choice? Excellent. Excellent. All right. I'm going to need to find it. All right. Now, you will need to bow while I anoint you with this. You are hereby forevermore a graduate. You are no longer an elfling. Inside and pull. Ah, it is now magical and it is yours. Of course. Of course. Your home you'll have to wait till tomorrow to try out. But of course you can take it with you. Of course. My darling, you look beautiful. Stunning. I remember the day you were born. I held you in my arms and I knew this day would come. I just knew it. You have made all of us proud. Oh, darling. I love you. I value you. I honor you. <laughs>